today I'm going to make a really quick um, everyday roast potato. So you know that, that um, because I'm Indian, we don't come from a culture of having a Sunday roast. We don't have, I wasn't taught at my grandmother's elbow how to roast potatoes. And this is not your bone, Goose. Look, this is bear's bone. How to roast potatoes and then to within an inch of their life and then toss them around in a colander. Hello, Shona. Um, until they fragment and then toss them into hot butter, all of that. I never grew up with that. Um, so I kind of found my own, own way and I experimented with every kind of oil, with duck fat, goose fat, butter, and I have found, believe it or not, olive oil to be the best, um, the best fat. And I dress them in a way where you can have them every day. So they're really light, but they're really crunchy and they're really gorgeous. So I'm just parboiling them at the moment, playing with the dogs. And then we'll go over and do these amazing everyday roast potatoes that, of course, I have to toss a little bit of turmeric into. But trust me, gorgeous. All right, um, it's too late to say, I think, don't judge me, by the way, that I cook. I think if you're going to judge me, you need to unfollow me because it's crazy. But I always leave the skin on, always leave the skin on because it's quicker and it's healthier and actually it just adds to the crunch. You know, as they start to separate and you get that rift between potato and skin and the oil gets in and crisps it all up. So this is just a really quick, healthy way of having those roasties whenever you want. Into here, oil, olive oil, um, garlic puree, salt, brown sugar, a hint of turmeric. If you've got any fenugreek powder, throw that in. That's what I do at Christmas. A bit of fenugreek powder really gives you this magical otherworldliness to the potatoes. Right. Reheat the oven at 220 so it's really hot. You're just crisping them. You're using your oven like a deep fat fryer. So 220, they go in until they're golden brown. Toss them once through the cook. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> 